Our beautiful beaches are some of the best things about the Tampa Bay area. You can head to the beach, you set up your umbrella and your chairs, you're good to go. A new law taking effect this Sunday has a lot of you confused about your access to the coastline. Brightside's Emerald Morrow is here with us in studio this morning. And Emerald, officials are saying, hey, do not panic. Yeah, that's right, Courtney, especially, you know, with the 4th of July coming up. Lawmakers want to make sure everybody knows that they're going to be just fine at the beach. But we definitely want to break down the law since there's been so much confusion about what it all means. So what exactly is this new law? The first thing to understand is it deals with public versus private property on the beach. And Governor Scott said the goal is to protect beachfront property owners rights. Now, the key here is the high tide line. Anything from the line to the water is always public property. Now, the dry sand, though, that can be private or public, but we all know that's where everybody likes to get there and set up and have a good time. However, it can be hard sometimes to know what's private. And there have been cases where homeowners have put up a big fight over beachgoers on their property. Now, this new law makes it harder for local governments to create ordinances to keep that access open. They would have to sue property owners instead. Now, officials say this bill will not cut off your beach access and the Pinellas County Sheriff's Office says it will not be going around kicking people off of the beach, but it might be a good idea this weekend to look at all of the signs while you're out just to make sure you are not on private property, Courtney. And this all starts on Sunday. So will you follow it? What do you think about it? Do you think that you should be able to plop down anywhere you want on the beach? You can post on your own Facebook page, Twitter, or Instagram accounts and type in our Brightside hashtag up with. Many in law enforcement say trespassing complaints. That's not what they're going to be out looking for. They're not going to be actively patrolling the beach.